Welcome to today's episode of Cooking with a Cockatoo. Today we're going to make wontons and wonton soup. They're really not that hard to make. And uh, I'm going to make pork wontons today. So I went and got a uh, pound of ground pork. I'm going to put that in my uh, bowl with some uh, minced ginger. And I've got some um, minced garlic. Got some uh, green onions. Of course, white pepper. Some red chilies, crushed red chilies. Same ones like you use on your pizza. I like my wonton zingy. salt and some poison sauce and we're going to mix all this together with our hands like this and this will be the stuffing for our wontons now that you've got all this squoosh together we're ready to start spooning it into the middle of our wonton wrappers. And you can use a food processor and turn this into a paste if you want, but uh, I, I prefer to just uh, squoosh it together with my hands. Okay, now I'm going to show you how to stuff and wrap a wonton. I get my wontons at the grocery store on sale. As you can see, I got these for 99 cents, just like my pork, ground pork, I got on sale, and it was uh, less than uh, $3. So we get us a wonton wrapper out. And you lay them down in a diamond shape. And you get your spoon full of the stuffing. Put your stuffing right in the middle. And then you're going to take you some uh, a beaten egg and put right along the edge of your wonton wrapper, one edge. And you're going to fold him over and kind of press him down as you fold him over. Then you're going to take him and flip him over. And what I do is I push in the middle and pull the two sides back so that the two flats come together. I stick them together. And there, there you have a wonton. Let's do another one. Uh, spoonful of our meat. Put on our egg our glue, fold them over, pressing the air out, and you stick the sides down. And I look to see which way will be the best to fold him up. So you take him and push him there, and pull the two ends together, and if you have to, fold the flap over and stick him. And there's another one. And repeat this till you've uh, went through all of your wrappers. Oh, for a fried wonton, I don't, um, I don't fold them up into the little, um, into the little boat. I just, uh, put in the filling and, uh, and then just fold them over as a, um, flat wonton. We're going to take some of them and we're going to fry them. And so we'll have some triangle wontons and we'll have some of the soup wontons. Now I'll show you how to um, steam them as soon as I finish making the rest of them.